Hello everyone, welcome back to GWT Goons. Today we got a new episode for you today. We are still the chef from last episode. Um, we are helping the grave family. We are going to uh, help this young man. You got my money. Because last time we sneak into, it's like basically like a Romeo yes. and Juliet family, you know, um, they're in love, and you know. I can't be bothered. Here, take. Thank you, Arthur. you Thank you. My God, what a woman. She's. This will get her killed for sure. What? Women's suffrage. Around here, they don't even like men voting. They bring back the monarchy given half the chance. Progress is a dirty word in these parts. Unlike incest. Excuse me? I don't want to marry my cousin Matilda. I want to marry Penelope. But they're gonna... Yeah. They'll kill they her in one of those rallies cousin. they're holding. They've done it before. Mister, you gotta help. No, I'm afraid I don't want no part of it. I'll pay. My family, we've still got some money. You keep saying that. Fine. Just... No more running around with letters. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not. Come on. I'm gonna get I'm going. Not, uh, what? What's it got another horse? That I was on the way. I just kind of took it. Come on. Come on. And this one's the heavy one. I'm waiting for you. We'll go around the property and take the road to town. Okay. Go on. Well, I need to get on that horse. Come on, boy. I'm thinking about like maybe get getting another horse or something. I mean, Good girl. Easy boy. Calm down. I like my Can't white horse. Calm. If we don't get there in time, my true love may be shot. If she but. wants to rally, you gotta let her rally. Well, good as the cause is. I can't let her become a martyr to it. I, I want to marry a flesh and blood woman. Not a statue in her honor. I'm sure they know what they're doing. There! There they are! Bo, oh, what are you doing here? I cannot let you go through with this. You'll be killed! I'm prepared to die for the cause, Bo. You know that. Do something, please! I just like me. Fight this map. Leave me alive. This is no laughing matter, sir. They need protecting from certain elements. Mostly my family. Penelope, I beg you. I'll tell you what. Your friend here can drive the wagon for us. It'll allow us to shout all the louder. Hooray! Miss yeah. Calhoun. Miss Calhoun. My friend here says he can drive the wagon. Well, Olive Calhoun. Normally, I like to drive myself, but today I feel like a man joining us sends the right message. Well, mm -hmm. I ain't never been in a protest march before, madam. Well, just treat us like the sheep and the folks attacking us like the wolves, and I'm sure you'll feel right at home. Shall we go? <clears throat> sure. All right, ladies. We know our song is a good one, and we know oh, our calls song. is a pure one. Yes, ma'am. Go on, sing Let's us a song. Take us down Main Street, right through town to the steps of the back of Road, Mr. What was your name? Arthur Morgan. Very good, Mr. Morgan. Not too quick, and not too slow. We need them to hear our voice. Like now, he started using his, like, wheels name now. Very good, very good. Mr. Morgan, are you an old friend of the movement? Calhoun, maybe a shotgun messenger if it comes to it. 
now, but it won't. Well, our message will be delivered peaceably, Mr. Morgan. You can keep your shotgun to yourself. <laughs> that guy's a slave. Just get out. Just get out of here. Look at these people. It's about to get exciting. I can feel it. You need to, like, pay more attention on those people. Get out of here. You don't need no help. Well, ladies and gentlemen, well, this is a great day for all of us. For today is the day we begin to live as equals. Equal. Ah. Yes, equals are fair Come on, and then. equal. This is unnatural. This is nonsense. Yeah. yeah. Woman and free, just Can as the founding fathers intended. Why? 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 Founding fathers, not founding mothers, you silly old goat. Hey, hey. 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 Philosophy dependent hey. on biology. What the hell are you doing here, boy? Keep your voice down. I'm trying to listen to the speech. Hello, darling cousin. Don't you ever speak to me like that. What are you doing here? Listening. I suppose. Go help Bo. His cousin is a moron. Stop them from ruining the speech. <laughs> Not like. I love it. She was like, stop them. Ruining the speech. Not like protecting his lover. Follow me. Can you can you see the batch? Can you see the batch? Just come over here. Can you not see how idiotic you are? Come on, Bo. Let's go. Quick now. We gotta go before they think twice. Oh, oh. Follow me. I know a place. It's an old battlefield no one goes to. Go on then. You don't wanna go back and hear the speeches? I ain't voted before, but kinda getting hot for voting rights. <laughs> I don't know whether to take you seriously, Mr. Morgan. My cousins are my primary concern right now. If everyone knows about Penelope and me... Everyone knows about Penelope and you. I know about Penelope and you, and I've been here only ten minutes. The sooner it's out, the sooner it's resolved. The sooner it's dealt with, you mean. We're dealt with. Our families, the Greys and the Braithwaites, we bury our secrets, and we bury them deep. Your secrets and your treasures. You know, Catherine Braithwaite's got a daughter. No one's seen her in years. She were right, you know, and Penelope said... Uh, I, I ain't heard about daughters. I heard about gold. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. Gold? I fear that's just a story, Mr. Morgan. But I don't know. I don't know anything about, you know, woman. I don't care about that. I don't worry about the money. This is awful. Nobody died. It ain't that awful. My cousins are vindictive bastards. My brothers are vindictive bastards. My cousins are worse. They started it. I know, but <laughs> no. you should leave. I will, as soon as I have enough money. When my family, we have money, but I don't. Is your family very rich? Yes, well, I believe so. But uh, they keep me out of the discussions. I have more of a artistic temperament, so. Well, is that what they call it? Yes. Oh, you made a joke. I really love her. I do. Well, stick around. Maybe you can die for her as well. I thought you were trying to make me feel better. <laughs> I gotta go. Me too. Oh, damn! I'm gonna be late. My uncle is quite as bad as you would imagine. Uh, here. Yep. Your payment. I was just look, waiting for the money. Excuse me. See ya. Not too bad for 30. Just drive around. Okay, boy. 
Let's look at where should we go? It's really obviously I got a mission there. Um I do I do want to place to put up a horse. Is that a place around? Oh, I don't know, there. I see it. It disappeared. Hmm. I don't know, is there a place I can do that? And I don't see it. It's a small town, so... I might... You know what, I might going back to the old camp and I can drive the train Not too bad, not too bad. We are driving to train. <laughs> Let's go. Folks. Why, hello there, sir. Good day, sir. Everything okay? Oh. Oh. All and right. Then. Well, good luck to you. <laughs> Not saying anything. Hey, fellas. Question mark. Oh, my. Never seen a strong man before. You want? You okay? <laughs> you do not look do okay. I look okay? <laughs> no. You look awful. <clears throat> Horrible. Look at me. Useless. I wasn't born to this. I didn't deserve this. I used to be gentle. Jeremiah Compson. Compson stead. Good for you. He looked That's like a anything to boast about. They took everything from me. <laughs> Who did? They. What did Who's they dying? take? My whole life. A whole way of living, a career. I stole a lot of things, but that's quite a lot to steal. Look at me here, living in the shit and the mud. I'm sorry. Yeah, let it out. My old house. The house my grandfather built. It's all dilapidated and destroyed. Repossessed by the bank. I'm sorry to hear that. I was supposed to live a different life. That's what everybody so says. Uh, only I could get my old things back. Personally, Ain't that easy. Watch. 
old pistol. My ledger. Where's this house again? Comes instead. North of Scarlet Meadows. <laughs> Banks says I can't go near it. I'm living rough over by Aris Field. Well, if I'm ever out that way, I'll see what I can do. Time. Time is hell. Mind if I join the party? Hey! I keep moving if I was you! Sorry, what? What did I tell you? Get the hell out of here! Calm down. Maybe you can help us. It ain't like this is going well. Really? Oh, shit. Nothing to lose, I suppose. Come on. The truth is, mister, our last batch of shine didn't turn out so good. You think you can help us with locating some ingredients? Oh, we make could you some reward you for your trouble. Moonshine, huh? Why not? The world could always use more moonshine, right? You yep. know, wild tobacco might give us the rich, earthy flavor we are looking for. Oh yeah, yeah? I got some. I have some with me. Go on, lazy bones. Toss the plants into the batch so we can test it out. Nope, Place them nope. in the hatch on the side of the still. Yeah. Here? And what? All right. I'm going to give this a taste. Mmm. Well, ain't so tasty. But dang if I don't get a prickly feeling. Real sharp. Well, that sounds kind of interesting. Why don't we rest up a spell and then whip up another batch later on? We got a rare victual in that chest there. Take it. I'd say you earned it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. So where's the box again? Still, I'm not. That then. This one. Hey, that's ours, you son of a bitch! Oh, I don't mean that. Dumb sons of bitches! It's the start of your ah. end, friend. Ah. 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 I don't mean that, but oh well. Because it's too dark, I can't see much. There. Let's have some moonshine, shall we? Mm. 
That's the power of moonshine. Yeah. You got a lot on? Ah, uh, just hunting for all this hillbilly gold that Dutch and Hosea seem to think is out there just waiting to be stolen. <laughs> Why? I got something. Mm -hmm. Could be good. Yeah? Yeah, I was in Rhodes talking to some of the colored folk. They said there's a gang of fools holed up in the swamps east of here. Who think they war ain't never ended? The Civil War? Yeah, apparently it's still raging in these fools' minds 30 years later. Okay. That ain't still my going on, to be These honest. ignorant fools are weapon dealers, and in their dealings, sometimes sit on a decent pile of cash. Yeah, I've been selling weapons to Cuba and South America for years. Anyway, the old boy I was talking to reckoned there might be a bunch of cash just sitting around. And failing that, maybe a nice stash of weapons. Just a bunch of crazies, Gardner? Exactly. I like that. Worth taking a look at least, isn't it? That was my thinking. Said it was at some place called Shady Bear, deep in the woods. Okay. <laughs> the silvers, or are we going to get more people? I was hoping you'd be in. If it's how they told it, it's gonna be something, all right. We'll see. This way, on me. Yeah. You know, I might have met these crazies before. You've been drinking again? No. Well, yes, but no, that's not how I might have met them. I think some of them harangued me and Sadie when we were coming back with supplies. Oh, Mrs. those Adler. guy. Yeah. And Mrs. Adler did just fine. More than fine, actually. She's terrifying. But I got a notion these fellers is one and the same. Yeah, we won't find no shortage of angry Peckerwood idiots in the state of Lamont. That's for sure. Is it really that different in this state? We haven't come far. It seems like it is. These boys got a manner about them, but I haven't necessarily noticed. All respect, Mr. Morgan. You wouldn't notice. Might call you a nigger lover. Because you yeah. riding like this. Because, yeah, exactly. Most because, of it yeah, is a, white. a glance or a word. And after that, a visit in the night. Well, out west, it's out west is out west and you're all who you are right? decent folks but some places down here they judge different well i don't know guess it can't be so easy for you lenny sorry you're caught up in this well mm -hmm. i guess their gold still shining and their guns still shoot <laughs> so i'm game for robbing any and every one of these bastards for all they got <laughs> okay then Plus, it beats being lynched back in Blackwater with all of you by my side. I guess it does. Feels like we're close. It's a rundown old plantation house down in the bayou somewhere. Let's take it slow. Be cautious. If, like you say, these crazies are sitting on weapons, we're going to want to strategize a little before getting shot at. <laughs> of course. They said find the old battlefield. Keep on going. Yeah, I've been here before. I can see the wrecked old Civil War weaponry. Where are the wrecked old Civil War holdouts? See that church up ahead? They're supposed to use it as an outpost. Heard they got men going between here and the big house all day. Okay. Look at this field. Imagine getting caught up in a fight like this. Yeah, I don't care to.
Hold those reins in. Let's just take a look around the place. I hear you. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone's here. We don't know that for sure. Let's have us a nosy. Hear that? Someone's on the track. Look there, the whack. Let's see where he's going. You're on me now. Right behind you. Let's keep our distance. Just two fellers out on the road. Hey, that looked like dynamite in the back there. He could turn off at any time. Should we move up on him? I think I see something. Into the apple, between the trees. Might be it. Might be. Keep it steady. Hey! Big plantation house. <laughs> Must be shady there. I reckon we can leave our mouse up there, off the trail. Good enough to me. Come on. We can get a view on him from that wall up there. Make sure you bring the shop shoe. I'll pick up. Mm, you get in cover there. Did you see anything? No. See a wagon, a little yes. wagon. Yes. There you're all right. They're armed. Almost a militia. They're packed. Down by the road. We do well to draw them into one spot if we're gonna make a pass at this. What else? Hey, move that scope over to the right. You ain't seen anything worth shooting the ceiling? Can you look again for me? And we came all this way. Can you look again and see if you saw anything? You got men covering the house? Cool. Them head on, fight them honest. Or you could go down there acting friendly. Friendly? With these folks? Just draw them into one spot, then I'll start shooting. Well, that might be the dumbest idea I've ever heard. But hey, I'm always up for performance. Especially for a black guy. <laughs> so, what do we do? Go on in, kid. Give them both barrels a charm. Wouldn't try anything less. Okay. I trust you. I trust you, Lenny. I got you covered. Uh, today is a fine and fabulous day. At all days. And so may it be. <laughs> Praise be, my people. What do you want? Praise be, my people. Praise be. <laughs> I come in peace to discuss the merits of glory and interest you in eternity. Praise be my people. Come on, kid. Now, uh, are you, have you, will you be saved, my brother? Praise be, huh? <laughs> Praise be. I want you out of here now, boy. Praise be, my people. Praise be. I said, get out of here. Praise be. 
or a, a, a great miracle shall strike you down, my family. Get out of here, you donkey. I said, a miracle shall strike you down. Get out of here, you nigger piece of shit. Praise me. The heavens await. The great angel Arthur shall knock you down. Oh, no. Nope. Maybe that was a bad idea. Just give the word. Gonna hit him head on. You save your play acting for Jose and the girls. <laughs> Fine by me. So, you gonna make a move? As soon as you see. No! I'm here for your guns and your money. Give them up. It's a loading thing. I need to like cut. I just want you Come on then.
Here. Come on. This is full of new rifles. We can sell those, right? We sure can. We'll check the rest later. Now, come on. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Get this back to camp. Yep. Yep. Yeah. We'd be better on the road, right? Go, go! Let's haul! Come on. G up. Fall in. Uh, doing some business with your brothers back there. You don't look like any kind of folk we deal with. You look just the opposite. The goddamn pair. <laughs> Seeing things change for you. Okay, then. Okay. Thank you, Arthur. Yep. Got two horses on the side. Look at us. Hey, the camp's in these trees up here. Let's get there. Eating good tonight. These are fine rifles, right? I'm gonna keep one just for me. Hey, I always enjoy riding with you, kid. <laughs> As always. Fight. Hey, you too. Anytime, Arthur. Mm. That's nice. Who goes there? I'm here. It's dude. me. Good to see you back, Arthur. I reckon you might be the most loyal of the lot. What else is there? Big old house in the swamps. Stole some guns. Good work. Yeah, it's a pretty good spot. Well hidden. Anyway, I won't disturb you. Okay, Arthur. Alright. I think I'll 
Well, guys, so thank you very much for watching another episode of GWT Goons. Hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed it, please give us a like and subscribe to us. And this is it for this episode. Wong out.